Don is non-committal and he's down for the whole like romance interaction. So we can invite Don because we know he's non-committal and then he could be our, our fuck buddy. I have to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so what do you think? And then Eliza could be our sparring partner. Thank you. What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? I think I must have. I think I did buy some perk. I don't know. Sid said. We do. Uh, I've got the romance bonus and the mean bonus. Welcome back. Bring in Don. Okay, so Don's gonna be Don's gonna be our our love buddy. That should work out okay. Oops, what am I doing? Invite to hang out at current lot. There we go. Get your ass over here, Don. <laughs> And then we can do our mischievous 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 we'll ask her her due date oh he's sleeping welcome back to many Chima <laughs> Damn, we don't want to go smooth apology. We don't want to go too nuts yet. We want to be able to really kind of mess mess with uh, people. Oh, we'll feel better, Miss Fujimoto. Wow, wow. This is really going round to bend here. <laughs> well, we also watch movies, so let's watch a movie. <laughs> let's watch Moonlight Massacre with Eliza Pancakes. Kumba, move me, Plevar. Oh wow, did they just like turn off the movie? <laughs> That's okay, Andy. Dude, I did not tell you to just turn off the movie. Do you not want to watch that movie? Stop fighting with each other and just watch the movie. <laughs> Oh, is it nice? What's in the pack? Is it coming, like, when is it coming out next week? The week after? That's right, watch the movie. Watch the movie. Oh god, I'm sorry, Natalie. Oh, there are new, like, flowers and things like that? That's cool. Okay, good. I'm glad, Absol. Aw, oh, boring movie. That's too bad. Let's get some popcorn together. Oh wow, that's neat. Brings ghosts to life again. Watch movie Sims of the Dead with Eliza Pancakes. Oh. Oh. 
Yeah, we're not doing terrible on points. We could be doing better, but we're okay at the moment. Did she head home? Yep, she headed home. We didn't do too terribly. We could have done better, but we didn't do too terribly. Alright, so... What's she looking like? 25% done. Only 25% done with her mischief interactions? We did some with Eliza. Yeah, watch that zombie movie and then go right to bed. <laughs> Just, uh, the other night watched... With our, um, with our roommate, we watched uh, the end of the first season of iZombie. Hi, Anne England. Um, and, like, Crystal, my roommate, she was like, this is bullshit. Her life is so hard. What is wrong with everyone? <laughs> hmm. Oh, okay, February 9th. Cool. Oh, my God, are all of you caught up on Crazy Ex-Girlfriend? If you are not, you should watch it. Because it's phenomenal. Uh, no, I can't hang out with you, Paolo. I'm sorry. But yeah, if you haven't watched Crazy Ex-Girlfriend, then I highly, 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 highly recommend you watch it. And if you're not caught up, you gotta get caught up. Um, Pride and Prejudice and Zombies? I don't know. I... I didn't read it, but I thought about seeing it. Yes, Crazy Ex-Girlfriend is amazing, Shizzy. It is so good. Um, well, sort of on the surface, it's about this, this girl. So, this woman, when she was a teenager, she had a very hard sort of life growing up with her mother was very overbearing helicopter parent and things like that so she finally convinces her mother to let her go to a fun normal summer camp so she goes to the summer camp she meets a boy and she falls in love when she in love when she's like 16 years old um and uh so then she you know she's with this kid and they break up like, he dumps her, and her mother, instead of being supportive, uses that as a reason to say, see, you wasted your summer, you could have been at mock trial. So she decided, like, from then on out, only to go to mock trial, and she didn't have any more fun, and she was, like, heavily medicated and all of that, and then one day, years later, like, ten years later, she is getting a promotion at her job in a law firm, and ends up running into this guy that she was in love with when she was 16 years old, and... He's like, hey, and he's like, I've been living in New York for six months. It's really kind of intense, so I'm moving back home. Everybody's really happy there. And in a moment of complete ridiculous abandon, she reassociates happiness altogether with him and <laughs> moves out to the town where he was. Uh, or where he's moving back to his hometown. She moves out there. And she keeps telling herself, oh, no, I didn't move there because I have feelings for him or anything like that. And she's, she, uh, basically, um, it's a very character-driven, character-driven show that has musical numbers that are really friggin' amazing. Um, it's very, very good. And it's got my new favorite ship on it, period. And I'm not gonna tell you what it is because it comes out of left field and it's wonderful and you should watch it. <laughs> On the train platform, searching for prime pickpocketing targets, Beeprol spots a well-known actress. Looks like that that's her bodyguard with her. Is it worth a try to pickpocket her? She might be too high profile. Um, we're gonna keep walking. Just for now. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna stick away from that for now. It's on, um... It's on, uh, what's it? It's, um, CW. You can find it on Hulu. And, um... The first episode has, the, like, it's just amazing. It's called the Sexy Getting Ready song because she goes on a date with this guy when she gets there. And, like, I'm, I'm quite tempted to just bring it up and play it uh, when, like, after our break, just bring it up on YouTube and play it. <laughs> and we can all watch it together. Like, not the episode itself, but, you know. <laughs> But if you have Hulu Plus, the show's on there, and I highly recommend it. Highly, 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 highly. 
All right. Um. Yeah, we can we can bring it up and uh, listen to that song because it's funny. Okay, so she wants to do push-ups. She got home. All right. So mischief interactions. We should get Don over here and work on romance with him when it's not in a club setting. Oh god, the show's so funny. It's it's just bizarre. I love it. But yes, there's a, a ship on it that came out of nowhere and I'm just like, oh my god! <laughs> Don's not sleeping, damn it. <laughs> I just realized it's like 3am. But if I start a club gathering, he has to come. Ha 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 ha. That's right. Hi, Eliza. Eliza, you go do you. Don. Don, where are you going? Ooh, Brighton Day. We could have a Don Lothario baby. Uh, oh, dag, dag. Middle of the night, club, club. We're gonna get to know him a little bit. Be like, hey. Tell knock knock joke. We're funny. Torka choosing. We should add telling jokes. To uh physique. Fuzzoob. Yeah. Schwabby Fox. Yeah. Hi Fat Fox. Yeah, we should add um telling jokes to it. Huh? Huh? Yes. Oops, ask a single why? What's going on? Why are we upset? Funny, let's just... Okay, he doesn't want knock-knock jokes, so we're gonna tell... Oh, he's upset about something. We need to stop being a dick. God, it's so hard. It's so hard with sims that are mean. Ask about career. <laughs> Compliment outfits. Canathoy? Yibs. And Fabi. Brighton Day. Let's be nice. Let's be nice. Gibara. The fool. Palifa Gribix. Oh. Narfa. Try to chat. Let's see. Yibs. Well, that's okay, Wikis. What are you crocheting? Kuzip. Cleavar. Oh, Nabaquink. Friendly. Discuss fitness techniques. We care about fitness. Compliment his outfit again. Ah, Vula Shaka Teebs. Finoy Cho. Ah, Beps and Nicole. Oh, yes. Yes, Don. Let's woohoo. I guess we've got to get him to a good place. He wasn't down with the funny, though. Deep conversation. Two DS for Christmas? Cool. Friendly. Discuss more fitness techniques. And then try for baby. <laughs> Romance. Let's, let's ask a little bit of a risque question. Let's see. Oh, a baby blanket. Cool. Okay. Okay. Let's compliment his appearance. Okay. Ziffle, yeah, jobs can be helpful. Uh, I hear ya. Why does my sim keep being an asshole? I hate when sims are mean. Mean sims are such a pain in the ass. Go pee. Oh, can you not? Is she going up there? Okay. Let's tell a compliment. Like, so you're cool. 
<laughs> Such my fault. God, I just... I don't know. We might have to... I don't know if I can handle dealing with a mean sib. <laughs> I know, I made her mean. But they're so annoying. Oh, Mobsy. Oh, how okay. Just gotta keep on top of it. Kneer, Pruba. Lamina Galpa Watini. Hana Kletz. No Oh, Fina. Glaive Narza. Is she still in the bathroom? Oh, the toilet's broken. Use the toilet. Oh, he's going to work out. Yeah, the TV was in front. Go pee! Yeah, no, it's dirty, right? Let's see, can we woohoo? Will it let us? Zombo phony. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Yeah! That works. No, he's just gonna stand there and watch me sleep. This samba. Oh. So. This is not awkward at all. Oh, our knock seven feet. Oh, you haven't, uh, Mudkip. Oh, they absolutely have to do the things that are thumbs up? That's interesting. So should we... Should we try for baby? Like, should we... Should we try for baby with him? What do you think? That's okay. We all gotta start somewhere. Yeah, let's have a baby. Woke up all flirty. Have a baby with me. For shoot, Barza. More choices. Romance. Try for baby in the closet. Boy. Fuck club baby. Oh. Ah. Be first. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Oh. Oh, Fill me with your fight club child. Stage lights. Oh, that's cool. Hey, Kellyanne. <clears throat> yeah, that's right. Closet baby. And then we need to eat. Have a quick meal of yogurt. <laughs> That's right, Nutkin. <laughs> we should hire a repair service and take a cold shower. So actually we can't hire a repair service yet. We can shower. 
And then we can hire a repair service. Yeah, it's nice doing stage work and things like that. And I'm not going to do the pregnancy test. We'll see, uh... We'll just find out the old-fashioned way. Yeah, that's right. Kiss me. Mm. We're not going to be able to fight anybody right yet. Oh, you might be moving soon? Sleep. Just have to hope that our members are incidentally mean to each other or hook up with each other. Oh, good. You know what? That's okay. We were calling her a fair person anyway. Short <laughs> How's this working out for you too? Okay, there we go. No, okay. Yeah. 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 Okay, Wes. Oh, he's he's good. Okay, repair person, get up here and fix my shit. Thank you. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> These two aren't awkward in the least. See, I guess we're just gonna need more members of the club. We can fit three more people. So, maybe in a bit, like when we get back. I want to give B-Prol a little bit of a makeover, change up her look a little bit. Oh, you don't have to do the pregnancy test. You can if you want to. <laughs> John's doing the pee-pee walk. There you go, Don. Oh. <laughs> Guys, they're so weird. <laughs> yeah, Seaproll. <laughs> we need to name the baby Seaproll. <laughs> Yeah, moving across the country is, is rough. That must be. <laughs> I'm probably gonna be where I am for the rest of my life. But that's okay. I like I like my town. Yeah, I haven't ended the gathering. I just figured I'd let them gain incidental points. <laughs> If it's a boy, Seaprol it is. <laughs> no. uh -huh. Oh, okay, we're romantic enough that he can nap in the same bed. That's interesting. <laughs> we got a lot of points for sleeping. <laughs> Stop eating the popcorn. Do I have to take the popcorn thing away from you? Is this an ice cream situation all over again? Eat some damn yogurt. I just keep them in my house all the time. Never end the club gatherings. Oh, you can nap no matter what the relationship? Okay. Yep, she's Beeprol because she's my alternate universe version. Shimba. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> and then she's gonna have to pee. Oh. Nope, not taking the pregnancy test. Oh. Not doing it. Yeah, go to the bathroom. <laughs> well, cause like, whenever you do the alternate universe stuff and shows you have like A universe, B universe. Got to doing all that alternate universe stuff now. The uh, infinite Earths in Flash. Whoops, glitch. Oh, I'm sorry about your haircut, Legendary. That happens. Yeah, we can be romantic with Eliza. 
But and he won't get jealous. Yeah. Dom won't get jealous. He doesn't care. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Oh, are they gonna are they gonna go have some tender lovins in the bed? Use the closet. They need to add porta potties to the game. <laughs> if I didn't do uh, YouTube for a living, I started Five Love. Maybe I'm not above the idea. <laughs> the world is definitely safer this way. <laughs> I'm checking my time. Uh... Yeah, I should just put- we should put a bunch of people in the club. Oh, the timer's gonna go off in two, one, done. There we go. So, we're gonna take our break. Um, I, uh, I should definitely just fill the club with people, and then we will always have it gathering. Like, always have it gathering. How does that sound to all of you? Do, do, do. Do, do. Hey, I'm streaming. Crystal's looking at me through the hallway like, are you streaming? <laughs> Alrighty, so we're going to take a break. We're going to save this. And we're going to take our break. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and would like to subscribe, there's a handy dandy button to click right there. Also, consider checking out one of these or one of my many other videos. I've been at this a long time, and I've got challenges, builds, and story-driven Let's Plays to suit any taste. And last but not least, come along and join me for my weekly stream on hitbox.tv slash sims3symbiote. Thank you!